Hello viewer, welcome to my channel. In today's video, I am going to share a very fast and tricky process of generating PDF file of any interface. In this video, I will use Blazor server side for example. But if you follow the same procedure, then you can also implement this in Blazor WebAssembly, ASP.NET Core, or in MVC project. It is 100% free PDF generating tools because I am not gonna use any NuGet package. If you also want this trick for ASP.NET Core project, then please comment and I will make tutorial for you. So let's start today's topic. First, I'm gonna take two classes. One is a student class and another one is mark sheet. Student ID for name, role, section, group name role section group another class is mark shape Subject, mark, grade, subject, this one is for mark, grade, for grade, This method will calculate the grade. It's a simple method. And for mark sheet, we should have a student ID. Okay, done. Now I am going to take a class for dummy data. DV class name say database class list of student here for mark sheet. This is our student list and we have to take a mark sheet list into a student class. So go to a student class and here get set this one. Get 
mark for student ID I. This is the method of getting mark sheets of an individual student. Here I am setting a student ID in mark sheet object. So construct of done. And then I'm going to return a student list get students which is return this global variable okay this database class is done now i'm going to create service classes service i student service make it interface public list of student student get students public student get student single student by student id add folder service and then create a class student service this one implement interface database class return database class get students same as dot first of default student id student id okay A student service done open startup class and service dot add scope okay go to index dot razor page using project name dot data inject project name dot i service dot i student service inject i js runtime js runtime code list of student students and then student student new student on initialized async copy this one paste here and then student service dot get students void get single student detail from this method and as parameter I will pass a student ID here so student equal student service dot get student 
Okay, done. Class row. Class call MD. First, I am going to load all students in a HTML table, which is this one. This is table head, and this one is table body. This is my student list, which is called students. Here we can see we take a column which name is action. Under this action column, I am taking button of every single row. When I click on this button, then it will get a single student information using a student ID and take it into a student object. So this table part is done. And this is the another part of my interface where after clicking on that button of an individual row, the student basic information will show in this part of interface. A student name, a student role, section, group, and it will also load that individual student's mark sheets in this table. Let's see the interface. So this is the basic interface of my today's tutorial. When I click on this detail button, then we can see a student basic information and a student mark sheet. Now, I want to generate PDF of this interface. So let's take a print button. Okay. When I click on this print method so it will call private print js runtime which is this one dot void Print. Let's create this print method of JS. So folder JS new item JavaScript file my JS. Print method window dot print and I also have to take jQuery library here so right click on it and then blind side library only this one install here it is, uh, open host.cshtml page here, and then link this to JavaScript files. Okay, done. Okay, let's run. Here is the button, let's click on it. 
Here we can see the left menu part and the top menu part about section in this report. Also, we can see all student list table on this PDF. But my main intention is I will show only student basic information and student mark sheet on this PDF. So how we can do it? Close it. And for this, I'm going to use a class. Let's say hide when print by using this class I am gonna hide left table which I use for a student list open main layout and then set that class on this div open nav menu dot razor set here and here okay done open my js.js file and here i'm gonna apply that trick first hide these classes and then after showing pdf again show that classes okay done let's run click any student here here is the detailed information of individual student let's click on print button here we can see only student basic information and a student mark sheet left menu top menu is height select microsoft print if you want to print directly from here or save as pdf save download okay done so here is our report okay Let's again click on print button. Close it. Here we can see this left menu, top menu again. So this is the trick of generating fast PDF on any project. Because I am not using any third party libraries, so it's totally free and we can use it in any project. Again, I repeat, if you want this example, for sp.net core project then please comment and i will make that tutorial for you thanks for watching have a nice day